<laughs> Seth, Sticky is excellent at retaining information. What is going to be his challenge this season with the giant scavenger hunt, with Benedict, and number two going missing? What is his challenge? Because some of that stuff is not always his cup of tea. Yeah, uh, you know, when it comes to like questions and like very hard answers, I come to like science and math. Sticky is really the man for that. But this season, Sticky has a lot of challenges trying just to get back together with his family and just trying to fit back in and trying to play his role like he did in the first season. And so, and, and my question is, Kate is not reunited with her dad. She did not what is going to be her challenge this season is not only the Avenger, but just in her family life as well. Um, Kate is, it's sort of like new territory for her, and, and for Million too. It's Kate barely remembers having a dad, and, and he doesn't really remember being one, so they're, they, they're sort of in this like family now, and they don't really have any experience with, with, with doing that before, so there's a bit of like, that growth that they have to go through to really to figure out how to like communicate with each other and, and how to like you know like how to actually like work together. What do you think? What do you wish that question. your character uh, could do in season two? We haven't seen it obviously season two, but what do you like if you could write a episode? What do you? What would you wish they, they could um, do? One long act action montage. <laughs> it's, it's Kate. Maybe maybe Kate goes off on her own for an episode in season two. We had that one really good episode um, in season one where it was Kate sort of goes off on her own. I would love to do that again. Of course, I mean, there's character growth where it's like she's learning to work with a team, I guess. But, um, I'm, I'm, I like I like solo episodes, you know? Um, or I like I Kate her. going on solo adventures. I love the intro to Kate. Like, that is still one of the best like intros when she comes in that first episode I'm like this is the character <laughs> and what about you with your character um i don't know i feel like a, a math montage <laughs> yeah 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 again everybody was so a bunch of, a bunch of <laughs> equations just papers filling up just that, that, um, no, but yeah, yeah, I feel like that would be good. You want your own, like, entire series? I feel like, I feel like everybody on the show should just have, like, an episode of just, like, super cool yeah. stuff. Like, yeah, yeah, that's true. We're going to pitch it for you. Yes. Spin off show. Is there any uh, particular scene that you can hint at, uh, so some people haven't seen the season yet, so that you really enjoyed filming or really was challenging for you in this coming season, as opposed to, to last? Uh, definitely the scenes on the ship. They are very, they are funny, uh, very funny. <laughs> they are, uh, they're, they're very, they're very intriguing too. Uh, I feel like definitely the ship scenes will have a big impact on uh, why people are tuning in. I agree. I, yeah. Filming on the ship was amazing, and there were so many really funny scenes on the ship. There's one scene um, where we sort of, I guess, we getting almost into spoiler territory where we, we, when we encounter um, an adversary, perhaps, mm -hmm. <laughs> um, on this ship. Um, and it's so funny, just like the dialogue, the writing on the show is so funny. Okay. It's, it's How do you keep it together? With <laughs> I feel like I would be laughing a lot of some of this scene. I mean, it was a struggle. There's okay. a lot of laughs. Okay. A lot of laughs behind camera, but you know, camera goes all the good. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I mean, there is so much crap in Kate's bucket, but what would you put in it if you had a choice? If I had to choose one thing to add to yeah. it, um... Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Sorry. Um, oh, I want to get it. I want to get a really good answer for this. Um, it's like I'm trying to think of something she doesn't already have. That's the thing. That's, yeah, that's, that's the thing. It's actually there's so much stuff in there. Bandit's world doesn't really have like computer stuff, so maybe maybe like um, some sort of like. Like cast, she's like my guy. Yeah. Um, matches. <laughs> I, I, that's what I, I realized. Kate doesn't have matches. I feel like they could really come that's in a, handy. That's a, a that's a good that's a good one. That is a, matches are always handy. I feel like they could come handy. Yes. Like, what if Kate needed to light a candle? I mean, yeah. <laughs>
I mean, she can burn a building down. I mean, she can burn a ten man with that. I mean, yes. hey. <laughs> oh wait, I just realized that might be a spoiler. Uh, um, so in last season, there was a point where we kind of questioned which brother Sticky would side with. Um, is there any points that that will um, maybe test his beliefs in season two? Uh, yeah, I feel like that will definitely be tested in uh, season two. Uh, uh, whether whether Mr. He stays with Mr. Benedict or leaves more on to security. Uh, I feel like we could uh, really make that bigger. It's like a bigger aspect this season. So definitely watch Wait, out. Wh so. Why do you think that he kind of questioned uh, during that during that time in last season? And why do you think he's still kind of I think because wrestling the, with that the amount of confidence he had. In the uh, first season, when he felt that way mm -hmm. with Mr. Uh, with Mr. Curtin, not that saying that he didn't have confidence with Mr. Benedict, mm -hmm. but just like the way he carried himself, mm -hmm. the feeling he instilled that in him. Yeah. Oh. So I think uh, in season two we may see another glimpse of that. Okay. So, uh, okay. okay. Makes for good. Let's put the TV. Want to give up the spoiler? <laughs> <laughs> we have to be, have to be, have to be like careful. We don't want to. We don't want to lead to spoiler territory for you. Do you have any? No, I'm good. Okay. How would you describe season two in three words or less? I'm going to choose this. I'm not actually that East Side. One word each, and then back and forth. One word each? Okay. <laughs> Intriguing. Who would say that one? Ah. <laughs> um, I'd say puzzling. Puzzling, okay. Uh, puzzling. Puzzling. So good. Curiosity. We'll do four since there's, you know. Adventurous. Oh, okay. What was that? Adventurous. Oh, a lot right. of adventures. Uh, Alright. I would say secretive. Okay. I'm gonna, I, I think fun. Okay. I think we have a touch base. Alright. And proud. Wow, so you had more than three, see? I, 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 I knew you could do it. I knew you could do it. <laughs> But we we'll, uh, commend you guys so much for what you do on this yeah. show and going to school and handling this. I'm sure the schedule. So definitely, great job, great job on it. If you had a real life scavenger hunt, what would your task be? Ooh, real life scavenger hunt. Um, I would uh, definitely pack the snacks. Yes. <laughs> very useful, very needed. I think I would probably be the one to figure out the clues. Or, mm -hmm. or um, maybe more accurately, I could describe that as I wouldn't let anyone else figure, figure out the clue. Yeah. You take it lead. And be like, no, I got it. You guys, I got it. Do it. Yeah, and then I'd be um, offering her water while she's trying to figure it out. What's the biggest difference between your real life and your character? Like, what's the, something that your character does that you would do? Uh, I say for me, antisocial. I'm not a really. I mean, like, I'm not. I'm not anti-social, I'm not, not so much as sticky as he is, he's very reserved, very to himself, only talks when he needs to talk, talk when he has to talk. Exactly like a character. I love it. I love I feel it like though. That's definitely one. <laughs> Maybe. Um, <laughs> I, love I don't. Oh, I got it. I got it. Really good. One. I'm not. Um, Kate really likes to like have her bucket. Um, she likes to like sort of be prepared for stuff. I definitely kind of go with the floor. That's, mm -hmm. that's the one. That's sort okay. of a, a, kind of a major thing. I I don't. Whenever I I go out, I put my phone in my pocket, my wallet in my pocket, mm -hmm. and then I leave, and that's it. Okay. That's all I take with me. Um, wow. I don't I don't bring a bucket water, full. <laughs> the bucket full of anything necessary okay. that I might need. Um, if I need something, I'll. Yeah. Okay. All right.